Everybody, good day. Mr. Uchimi here. First thing you do when you get your fetal pigs, you need to identify the sex of the pig. If we flip over to this one, flip a, uh, the, look at the posterior end, you'll see an anus. Right underneath that anus, you'll see a, a urogenital papillae. Alright? This is a female. If we go over here, we flip open that tail, you don't see that protrusion. All you see is the anus. If you lift it over, right underneath the umbilical cord, you'll see an opening right underneath the umbilical. This is called a urogenital opening. This indicates that this is a male. Let's go back over to the female. You look at mammary protrusions. They're called mammary papillae. So as you're starting to realize, papillae just means protrusion. These also indicate nipples. The female has nipples, but also... The male has nipples, so you can't use that to determine the sex of the pig. We'll look at the ears, called a panay. If you look at the nostrils, these are called nares. Nares. Let's flip it open. Let's start from top to bottom. On the sides, in the, on the sides in the oral area, in the mouth, you have something known as canines. These are the front teeth of the pig. Very sharp. So be careful when you go inside the mouth. The roof of the mouth has a hard covering known as the hard palate. Right underneath the hard palate, I mean literally right underneath, it becomes smooth. This smooth area is called a soft palate. Open up even deeper. At the very bottom of the throat, you notice something known as an epiglottis. This job is to prevent food from going down your trachea, also your windpipe. That's what happens when you start coughing when people say, oh, it went down the wrong pipe. This area is your tongue or the tongue of the pig on the sides of sensory papillae. Once again, protrusions. These are also known as taste buds. To do a quick recap of what we just covered, this is a male because it has a urogenital opening underneath the umbilical cord right here. Mammary papillae doesn't indicate the sex, but as you can see, they're just the nipples of the pig. You have the anus. You have the pene or the ear. You have the nares. You have the canines. You have the hard palate. Right underneath the hard palate, which is on the roof, you have the soft palate. If we open it up even deeper, we have the epigotis, which prevents food from going down the trachea. You have the tongue, and you have the sensory Papillae. If you have any questions, just email me or contact me in class. All right, have a nice day.